I was like a chef uh, in uh, some small restaurant. Uh, I had pretty good salary, but I just realized that that's not what I want to do and that this job will not bring me up. So then I just decided, okay, so I have to do something. And of course in Asia, and Asia was the best. It was a dream for me. When you come back to, to Prague and you see that the Prague is not the biggest city in the world, eh? you start actually to think differently. Hey there, I'm Kevin Longa and this is Taste, a documentary series that features the undiscovered true stories of the real people who make our food around the world. And what you just saw there was a short little teaser for one of our upcoming Taste with Europe season episodes. And it's about a chef called Irji Stift. And he's a Czech chef who actually was able to look inwards at himself and see that he needed to look outwards toward the world and introduce Czech Republic to Asian cuisine. And uh, Czech Republic hasn't always had the best reputation for welcoming in immigrants. And that was definitely the case for a lot of the Asian chefs that Chef Irji brought into his kitchens. And so he was able to kind of help bring Asian cuisine and Asian cooks to uh, a country that was very closed off, especially during communist times. And you know, there's a lot of viruses going on right now. Uh, and of course, one of the most dangerous viruses there is, is racism. And so I'm just always really impressed with how chefs are able to bring people together with food and break racism better than any, you know, war of attrition or things that just, just are destructive to society. They're able to do something constructive with their food and bring people together. And so I just really encourage you to, uh, while you're cooking during these times or while you're eating during these times to think about the different cultures and different foods that you could be trying, those different recipes. Try a new recipe from, from Asia, from the Middle East, from South America, from wherever in the world. Try that restaurants, especially Asian restaurants and Chinese restaurants that are hurting if you can afford it. Get takeout from a Chinese restaurant near you or from a Cambodian or Burmese restaurant or Vietnamese or Laotian or what have you. I believe that the best way to travel the world is through food. And since we have to restrict our movement right now, I think the best way to travel is to bring different cultures to our home and create it right in our own kitchens. And so I just really hope that you can stay home uh, and stay hungry for the things out there that are just absolutely delicious and diverse and just wonderful. <laughs> so yes, uh, I'm going to be posting more of these types of videos uh, that kind of publicize and tease the upcoming episodes for the Taste with Europe season. So be sure to follow and subscribe uh, during these weeks and months to come. And yes, stay safe, stay home, and stay healthy. <laughs>